Hi guys and dolls, welcome back to another video. It's Michelle from Michelle's Manis. Today I'm using these gorgeous products uh, to create a set. Again, forgive my application. Please, 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 please. I am getting back into acrylic. Um, I had about a month off, not doing anything, and it did not go well. I mean, <laughs> my month went well. <laughs> By getting back into acrylic, is I'm finding it truly difficult. Um, I am going to do some online, free online training, but some online training. So that one is number 644 from Cafe Nails. I think uh, she's on YouTube as well as in, on Instagram. I will link her specifics down below cafe nails 19 i think on instagram it's gorgeous gorgeous little bit of a shimmer little hint of a shimmer in it in that purple but it's a pretty purple i wanted to put it down as a base for uh, that beautiful glitter that you saw, Hestia from Sparkle Supplies UK. Stunning, stunning, stunning chameleon glitter. So on the pinky and the pointer, I do full cover with the purple. But on the pinky, I use it as a base for the glitter. The pointer is just going to be pure purple. I did speed it up a teeny tiny little bit because the video was a little bit long. But uh, like one and a half times, not much, really. I do, I'm having a lot of, I'm struggling. I'm really, truly struggling with acrylic application. But one thing I'm really proud of is I am not flooding the cuticles or the sidewalls or anything like that. I am doing really well that way. And my shaping is is coming along too, mostly because it has to. My application's so bad. <laughs> Yeah. Yay. I find myself having to file quite a little bit. But that's okay. I'm I'm okay. I still I love acrylic. I will not give up. I will get better. I will get better. So on these two, it's I don't know why I showed you both nails because they're both exactly the same. I come halfway down the nail. Uh, with the glitter and then the rest of it is this beautiful purple up to the cuticle half the glitter I I wanted to keep it a little bit see-through I mean on the see-through part of the nail I wanted there to be a little bit of a see-through aspect to it if that makes any sense at all if I'm making any sense to you please let me know because sometimes I don't make sense to myself So then I, I put I put the acrylic down to a certain point and then I put the glitter with clear acrylic of course um, on the rest of the nail and I outline it which I didn't show in the beginning but I do outline it with a little bit of uh, Madame Glam's office gossip just to give it a, a little outline just so it's not like bare glitter on the nail I don't know but it looks okay it looks fine and on the pointer I put some Swarovski that's right Swarovski crystals they're absolutely gorgeous I'm trying to get used to this hand as well I'm trying to loosen it up a little bit because it's still really stiff and I've used her for well, I got her for Christmas, and I used her Christmas Day. And I've used her pretty much every set I've done since then, so she's not loosening up very much yet. I'm sure she will with time. But I'm just a mess all over the place. I really do appreciate you guys hanging out with me while I do these these little sets for you. I 
I gotta tell you, I have been on Instagram and YouTube since last March, so it's almost a year. I'm still only at, what am I at, two... 260 or something like that. I don't know. I don't know how many subscribers I am at for sure. Uh, my Instagram, I can remember when I was excited because I had 60 followers and now I have almost 900 followers. The nail community is so inclusive, so supportive. It's ridiculous. It's amazing to me how a group of men and women alike uh, bond, come together and, and talk and, and laugh about nails. But I guess because I'd never been a part of that before, I didn't realize it. I didn't realize how how lovely the community is, how supportive it is, how, you know, how many wonderful friends I've made over the last year. It's it's great. And I did put clear acrylic down there on the pinky. I have no idea why because I am going to dip into clear acrylic before I dip into the glitter to apply it on the nail. Just not thinking. My phone was acting up. I, I record on an old iPhone. It's a 7 Plus. Um, previous video or two previous videos I did, I can't remember. It would just shut off, just stop working. And I'd lose footage and everything else. Uh, one video I had to scrap all together because I, I'm not doing these nails again. That's it. I don't care. <laughs> so, um, because my phone is above my head when I'm recording, I don't really see what's going on on screen. And when it shut down, of course, it's not mirroring on my iPad anymore either. But uh, it was overheating was actually overheating because the last time it shut down when I was actually doing this set I looked and it said your phone is overheating so it shut down till it cooled down I guess I hope I hope I fixed the problem it said to get rid of extra apps and all that jazz you guys look at this glitter isn't that absolutely gorgeous it goes from a purple that it is, it's almost exactly the color of the acrylic that I'm using from Cafe Nails by Gina. And it goes to this gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous teal. It is freaking stunning. I love it. Love it. I bought that one, I think it was a Black Friday sale that I purchased. I purchased six uh, from SSUK. Sparkle Supplies UK. I purchased six and it was 25% off. That's why I went there. But like I told you guys before, I'm not really good at picking glitter out on a website. It doesn't look that great to me. But then when I get it home, I love it. But I picked out six and I thought, you know what, I'm just going to go for it. I knew a couple of them were really pretty because I saw them on other people's channels. This one was a shot in the dark. As was... Uh, Gerber, I purchased Gerber, um, Rose Metal or Metal Rose, one or the other, but I thought with a name like that, how can it be ugly? <laughs> um, I did a whole video actually of the ones that I bought from Sparkle Supplies UK and then some that Trey had sent me uh, over the Christmas holidays and some she sent me back in, in the summer. yeah there is a video and a swatch video of those if you want to have a look now I put clear acrylic or the purple pinky and I didn't need to that was because there was already acrylic on the nail on the clear tips it's best if you put down a little bit of clear acrylic first. It helps the glitter adhere a little bit better than just working on the, the plastic tip. These are the Gel-X dupes from 
AliExpress. A bought stilettos. I bought them for myself, to be quite honest, because I've gotten lazy. I've been wearing them now for the last few months. And I bought stilettos, and I thought, I'm never going to wear a stiletto nail. Why the heck did I buy those? But they're great for, for uh, practicing on. They're just a little more expensive, you know, than the 500 count nail tips. A little more expensive, but that's okay. But I will never wear a stiletto nail because I seriously, literally will poke my friggin' eye out. It's really dusty where I work. I work in a factory. I run the, the paint shop of a windows and doors factory. I'm coordinator. Anyway, it's really dusty, and and there's little itty bits of vinyl, bits of vinyl floating around all over the place, and I am constantly rubbing my eyes because there's always dust in my eyes, and I'm telling you, I would blind myself absolutely. the The length you see there is the length that I'm perfectly comfortable with. Anything longer than that, and I'm I'm very aware of what I'm doing let's just say that so see I've outlined the glitter I'm gonna put some gems on the index finger that's just a little bit of glue so I can take these babies babies back off <laughs> they're so oh they're so pretty Swarovski's they're like they almost perfectly match the color of the chameleon in the glitter almost perfectly they're so beautiful little bit more glue so see I lost the footage where I was lining outlining the glitter on the nail that's crazy my phone was Shutting off on me. Like this, it's Sunday, January 16th today. And in a couple of weeks, or in, in about a week, I'm going to be doing some painting in the house. And I won't have time to do any, any videos for YouTube. So I thought I better get a few done this weekend just to have a little buffer, you know. So I've, I don't know, yesterday I did two, today I did three but my phone kept shorting out on me kept getting overheated and it was it was a rough go but I got there I got there I gave myself a little bit of a little bit of a buffer I'm okay oh my god I love those gems glitter is absolutely gorgeous this set does it absolutely no justice at all or my camera actually they're quite pretty in person I really like them but on camera they don't look that great that glitter oh it is stinking gorgeous. Well, that's just about the end of the video. So I hope you enjoyed hanging out with me today. If you did, please like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Share if you like. And I hope to catch you in the next one. Ciao for now. Bye.